IndyCar returns to PIR with Sunday's Grand Prix of Portland. Fox 12's Nick Krupke was at Portland International Raceway as a group of high school students from Beaverton got a behind-the-scenes look at careers in motorsports with Girls Day at the track. Ladies and gentlemen, start your engines at the Grand Prix of Portland. I think racing has always been like my dream. Uh, I've been into cars since I was young. Have you ever done a 24 over race? Um, no. Corbin Cantu, a high school senior at base, Beaverton's Academy of Science and Engineering. Biomedical engineering would be great. Uh, but honestly, this is changing my mind just a little bit. I also get air jack on the four car for pit stops. Seeing is believing. These women got to see a future for themselves in an industry that they might not have thought of before. Chip Ganassi Racing and PNC Bank hosted a handful of STEM-focused students from base for Girls' Day at the track ahead of IndyCar's annual stop in the City of Roses. You're looking at these cars going way too fast, and I'm like, just what's going on inside their head when they're driving? Like, I gotta go fast, I gotta turn here. The kids took a spin around the pits to learn what it takes to prepare drivers and their cars. Any, like, strategies of, like, tires and how many tire compounds there are. Tires, gears, and the women who help make it all go in the garage. I've been recently, you know, been a little worried about, like, what I'm gonna do for college and everything, yeah. so I think this is very, like, kind of gets me a jump start on like ideas and like what pathways I can go into in college, especially to like get here. This is my first year as a race engineer on the IndyCar side, but I was a race engineer on the sports car side before coming here. So the base students heard from Danielle Shepard, a lead engineer for six-time IndyCar champion Scott Dixon. She said that when she was younger, she didn't really see it. She didn't see the fact that it was male dominated. She just thought it was so cool. She didn't even look at that. She just thought, oh, cars going super fast, that's fun. And I want to do that. Just with the skills that you get at a STEM school like BASE, you can really do anything. And it's those connections and networking and getting out and learning new things that can lead you to a career of joy. And I was so excited the way that she inspired these women today. So yesterday, car was really good out of, out of the gate. Even Scott Dixon himself met the kids who might one day have a future career in motorsports or the medical field, as the students also toured the portable on-site medical facility. This experience has been very fun, and I'm glad I got to come, and I had the opportunity to see the inner workings of the car, see part of the medical field, even though I'm not as interested, but my friends are, and I'm glad that we all got to have fun. Indy cars started coming to PIR 40 years ago, back in 1984. Maybe now in the future, some of these girls from base be making a tour stop here as well at Portland International Raceway at the Portland Grand Prix. Nick Krupke, Fox of Oregon.